Hey guys, this is Fading Angel XOXO, and today I'm going to be doing an unboxing, even though it is already unboxed, but I thought might as well show the public. So this is my monthly, or not monthly, it's like every four, it's either every three or four months. This is the, um, the Fortune Cookie Soap, um, soap box, and this, um, company makes their own products, everything is theirs, um, so you don't get any weird products that you don't know what they are. Um, so this is a subscription box. It is 20 bucks every, like I said, 3, 4 months. So it's actually pretty good. They give you a good amount of products. Um, about 8, 9, 10, something like that. This month, or this, this round's theme is for fall. So it's Witch Please, which you'll get the idea why they have it like that. Um when I open it. So, when I open it, first thing on top, sorry for that, is the actual card that has all the information on it. I'm sorry about the glare, I'm using the flash because it's, I don't have lights. That light does not work and that's the only other source of light. Um, so yeah, this is, it has all the products on it, and then on the back it has a coupon code for, I think it's 10% off. Yeah, oh no, $10 off. Um, yeah, $10 off anything. So this is the actual soap, and I already, like I said, I've already opened it. So this is the soap. It's ruby red, and it glitters, and... It smells like cinnamon and it smells like fall. Like you know how they have like fall candles and how they always smell and they smell really really good. Like pumpkin, um, cinnamon. That's what this smells like. It smells so good. So that's the actual soap. That's why they call it fortune cookie soap because you actually get a soap that's shaped like a fortune cookie. And it is called. There's no place like home, fortune cookie soap, so this is themed after the Wizard of Oz. If you couldn't figure that out. Next we have BFF's whipped cream. So this is this is like a hand cream. And there's three or there's four different ones. I got BFF's, which is blueberries. Um it's right there. Or no right there. Yeah, if you want to read it, you can go ahead and read it, pause it, read it. We're just going to move on. The next, this is Flying Monkey's Personal Space. This is an, a room fragrance. Um, to me, I kind of get like a laundry scent, like laundry detergent, which I love the smell of laundry detergent. It smells so good. And this is an actually a really, really good size for traveling. I mean... <laughs> This is for rooms, but for those of you that like things to smell really nice like I do, I usually I spray my room with like my Bath and Body Works stuff because they don't always make the sense for it. So this would be really nice. Then we have a little itty bitty tiny baby perfume. Yes, this is a perfume. And it is supposed to be... It is called the Shiz Perfume. Yeah, that's interesting. It smells a little earthy, is what I get from it. Like, when you open it, if I can... When you open it, it looks like that. It smells kind of earthy. Like, I know the smell, but I don't know if it's earthy or if it's just familiar. Um, next, we have a hair oil. It doesn't say it on it, but this is a hair oil. It's like a, a dropper... What does this smell like? Sorry for the weird focusing. This is my phone. It it kind of smells bad. Like the people who try to make the stuff that smells like cookies and stuff. This is kind of what that smells like. How it smells just weird. That's what this smells like. But I don't use hair oil, so I'll probably give it to somebody. And it is called Hair Flip Hair Oil. It pretty much just gives you instructions on how to use it. And this smells pretty much the same. It is a walnut facial scrub. Ah, sorry. So when you open it, 
it looks just like, like, I don't know if you can see it. it, looks just like any other apricot scrub, like, if you can kind of see it, it, that's what it looks like. It smells a little bit better than the hair oil, but it smells pretty much the same. And then, we have a hand sanitizer called Roy G. Biv for the rainbow. It's called OCD hand sanitizer, and this smells like laundry detergent. Like, it smells so good. Like, words cannot express how much it smells good. And this is called, yeah, Roy G. Biv. Where is it? Yeah. Yep. And then the last thing, yeah, this is the last thing. This is, I don't know if it's a, my mom said it's a bubble bath, but it seems like it would be a bath salt. No, it's bubble bath powder. Miss Popular bubble bath powder. Doesn't smell like bubble gum if that's what they're implying. It kind of smells bad. I don't know if I, I don't take baths, I take showers. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed my box, or just seeing what I got in this box. Um, I'm going to film another subscription box and then the stuff I got from, like, the internet that I ordered. So stay tuned for that video, and I hope you guys enjoy. Leave a comment, thumbs this video up, add it to my favorite, or your favorites, and subscribe to me for more videos like